Uh, it's yeah. a great pleasure in talking to you, Dr. Venkat, and uh, for scoring a top uh, topmost rank Thank you, uh, in PGA Chandigarh session 2021, Thank you, and uh, for for a session 2021 PGA of uh, DM Gastro, and mm -hmm. uh, rank number two, a uh, topmost rank uh, in the institute. Thank you, I bring all the wishes from all the entire team of Spear Institute and all the faculties of Spear Institute to you. Thank you, sir. And, Thank you. Uh, and we, yeah, and we want to know uh, about uh, Dr. Venkat. And uh, where is Dr. Venkat coming from? Where he did his uh, MBBS, where he did his medicine? And why do you want to do a DM gastro? Sir, I, I belong to Andhra. So I did my MBBS from Bihar, uh, SK Medical College, Muzaffarpur in Bihar. And then I went to do MD medicine from Government Medical College, Chandigarh. Sir. I passed in July 2020. So after that, uh, at that time, I was not sure what to do in DM. Actually, I had an inclination towards cardiology and gastroenterology because of the interventions, but I was not very sure. So I uh, decided to like, do SR ship. So I went to Ames Rishikesh and there I was doing SR ship in medicine. So in like late November before the uh, Ames and PJ exam, then I decided that, okay, I'll, I, I'll try, I'll see gastro, I'll try gastroenterology. So I gave the exam and then slowly I started developing the interest. Like my interest, I, I, I was equally interested in cardio and gastro, but I slightly started in, inclining towards gastro. So uh, at that time, sir, in Rishikesh, it was very difficult to uh, like uh, balance the work and studies. So I left the uh, uh, institute. I joined Speed also in, I think, late December. And from mid-January, I started preparing. And I was sitting and preparing at home only. So uh, now, uh, can you share uh, your preparation strategies? Uh, when, when did you exactly start? How many hours per day you utilized? And what all you did in those hours? Sir, exactly, I think I, I, I started around January 15th or 20th, or this year only. And before that, I was not studying. So initially, I was not, uh, I didn't know what to study. So in the initial days, I used to only watch speed videos. So slowly and steadily, I started uh, realizing that, okay, I need to study Schlesinger from cover to cover. So then slowly and steadily, I start, I, I, I bought the book and then I started studying. So I finished Schlesinger one, I, mean, look, I, I studied at around 75 to 80% of Schlesinger, not the entire thing. But, uh, and then uh, from the videos, we, we learn, we like tend to know what are the topics which are important. So I started revising only th like those topics. And uh, for medicine parts, sir, actually, uh, when I started preparing, I thought I'll give aims first, then I'll, uh, for NEET, I'll study medicine. So I, I didn't study medicine initially in these three, five, four or five months. So I was only studying Schlesinger. <laughs> Sir, that's, that's, that was the strategy because I... Strategy, okay. I, I never studied Schlesinger, so I never wanted time. I needed time to complete. So, And uh, for the medicine, the only thing which I was doing was I was uh, solving the speeds uh, tests. The I, I was not able to watch the entire videos, but the test uh, test module I was solving. So that was helping me a lot. So that was the strategy. So were you, were you not preparing for uh, general medicine gastro at least? I mean, did you not feel that something if I asked from Harrison, that area I've covered, uh, Sir, uh, are you very actually, sure that only slicing will be done? No, in AIMS, I was sure because in November, at least uh, they, when they when I gave the exam, I knew that there was no medicine. I didn't know the gastro where the gastro was from because I never read slicing it. But I knew that, okay, there is no medicine. So I knew that, okay, I only need to read gastro. So I, I, what my plan was that after AIMS, there was at least one month gap for a PJ exam. So I thought after that, after AIMS, in that one month, I'll read a medicine and then see. So that was my strategy. Sir. So did you read, did you read medicine in one month? <laughs> I couldn't, but yes, no. I, I, I only solved the, uh, like, uh, test module. MCQs. Because it, it was not, I, I realized that one month is not enough to read medicine entirely. So very, very good strategy. Great move, uh, time saving yeah. and uh, it worked actually, it worked. Yeah. So uh, now what will be your uh, advice uh, to people who are preparing for uh, DM Gastro for Institute uh, and NEET exam? Sir, uh, for Institutes, because in AIMS also, I, 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 I was not in the merit list, but I, I got 13th rank. So I, I, in AIMS, I remember that they only asked um, Schlesinger. So it is around 75% of the, 75 questions out of 80 is only gastro. And uh, four or five are from Biostats. And sometimes they are asked one or two questions. 
some years they ask for uh, some years they don't for from medicine so it, it it it's not worth it to treat medicine for those one two questions in the biostatistics sir uh, uh, when we do thesis uh, on, we usually do stats so that much stats is enough they don't ask many anything else they only ask the stats which we usually use in during our thesis preparation and all and for uh, and for the 75 questions only slesinger is enough even i when i started i i heard from some seniors that you need to do journals and everything but i felt like no it is not important maybe two or three questions comes but it is like if you focus on slesinger you will get a rank that i uh, realized and for medicine sir uh, pgi in pgi i have heard that they usually focus few uh, topics like rheumatology critical care infection uh, and hematology these are the topics where where they focus a lot but pgi's uh, format is very dif different sir from neat the medicine part also they are more practical oriented so so sometimes like there are very few one liners so i think uh, your 3 years uh, md knowledge also helps overall okay so uh, understood now uh, in a, in a, in a day were you working or preparing for full time for so, last sir, from months? january 15th onwards i left the job and i was preparing full time and uh, what was your schedule how do you prepare i mean what do you start how do you start schedule sir you... i don't think we are very consistent everybody uh, so some days i would uh, like clock 10 hours 12 hours but there some days they will, i won't even study for one hour so i think whatever works best for you is i think uh, the like uh, that is best because some in everybody is like not very that consistent so i think yeah <laughs> matlab some days i used to study 10 12 hours also but some days like there were bad days also so <laughs> very very good very good now where are you right now in chandigarh sir yes sir i just reached chandigarh so tomorrow i'll go for admission admission and yes, very sir. good very nice time very nice time yes sir yes. and uh, a good time ahead and uh, and good days and good years ahead in uh, chandigarh and uh, yes sir yes and it is it's, it's that's it no i mean i think done everything done i mean the yes, career sir. is completed <laughs> i hope so, so i hope yes yes now uh, joining automatically you will come out and uh, it will the, the system will take you from there and yes, your consistent effort will make that yes. complete yes so once again on behalf of uh, the entire institute uh, i wish you all the best and all the success and uh, years so to come as a great gastroenterologist thank you sir thank you so much thank you thank you